Hey guys, this is Mr. A Crizzy here, and welcome back to another movie review. Today's movie review is going to be on the Disney movie from 1982, and that's going to be on Tron. So the story of Tron goes like this. When talented computer and computer engineer Kevin Flynn finds out that 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 Ed Ed Dingler, an, an executive at his company, has been stealing his work, he tries to hack into the system. However, Flynn, Flynn is transported into the digital world where he has to face off against D Dingler's computerized likeness, Sark, and and, and the and the impossing master control program. Aided by Tron and Yori, Flynn becomes a freedom fighter for, for the for the unpressed programs of the grid. And there you go. So, I I first heard I first heard about this movie a long time ago when I when I was watching this documentary film called The Pixar Story, and I, I've heard of this movie for several years, and I and I along with Tron Legacy, and and so all the way up until until recently, after watching the last episode of Moon Knight, I, I on Disney Plus, I watched the movie Tron on, on on Disney Plus, and and I gotta say this movie this movie the first Tron was actually a really cool movie. It was actually super cool, and and and, and I gotta say that the shots and the filming and the principal photography. The, and the cinema photography, it's 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 nice looking for the '80s, and and I do like how how the opening scene basically takes place at an arcade where it's like where, where the players are like playing an arcade game called Tron, along with all all the other arcade machines. Like it, it's a super cool looking film when you think about it, and and plus and plus when we get to like the the life cycle scene, that that the, the life cycle scene in, in, in Tron was actually what was was actually was actually made made in computer animation because Tron was actually what one of one of the first. One of the first movies in history that actually used computer animation, because because like I said, when we get to like the life cycle battle scene, like the life cycles were actually computer animated, and this was actually like one of the earliest movies that used computer animation, and and, and this was like way before Toy Story came out, like and and that and that's the re and and that's the part and that's the part where where I first heard about this movie when I, when I was watching the Pixar story, like. Like like how John Lasseter was working at Disney as an animator, and and his friends of his were working on the movie Tron. Yeah, because because I because I, I bet the animator I bet the computer animators who worked on the life cycle battle scenes like the life cycle scenes and, and the way and the way they they use computers to create animation for some of the scenes in Tron it's actually pretty cool for for its time in the eighties like while, while while Pixar was working on the short films like when, while Pixar was working on the short films like like on Luxor Junior and Red Stream and Tin Toy yeah because. And I gotta say, yeah, and I gotta say, Tr Tron was Tron was just was just a really cool movie, and it's and it's also a, a it's also a, a a a very good movie too from from nineteen eighty two as well. And I gotta say, the actors in this movie, the actors all did it all did a good job. They, it it looked like they were having fun for the life cycle scenes. Like it looked like they were having fun, and and Jeff Bridges, I know Jeff Bridges was in was in Tron, and Jeff Bridges, I I thought he did a good job playing Kevin Flint, like Jeff Jeff Bridges, I I thought he did good. So overall, Tron was a was a, was a really good was a very good movie from 1982 from from Disney, and I'm gonna give Tron four out of five stars, yeah, or three and a half out of five, but yeah, if, if you see my review, if you see my ratings on Letterbox, you'll you'll know what I'm talking about. So yeah, if you have Disney Plus and if you haven't seen Tron yet, then I definitely recommend it for sure. So there you have it, guys. That's going to be it for my movie review on Tron. And that's going to be it for this video. So make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And as always, thanks for watching. And until next time, this is Mr. A. Crizzy saying goodbye, everybody, and that's about it.